Good morning everybody. It's Friday and the sun is shining. Um, and I'm going back to starting them in the car like I did before. Come out for afternoon tea with a friend of mine. So I'm just in the car park. Oh, that might be her there. Uh, waiting for her. Um, yeah, I hope you've all had a, a lovely week. So yeah, we're having afternoon tea. Ladies at lunch today. Very nice and excited. I like an afternoon tea. I'm back home now, but I had a lovely afternoon tea uh, with my friends. Some lovely little sandwiches. Um, and then, of course, cheeky scone or scone. How do you say it? Scone or scone? I've always called it a scone. Craig calls him a scone and he always moans at me. So let me know, scone or scone? Anyway, uh, we had that as well. So back home now, just doing a little bit of stuff in the house before I go and pick the girls up from school and a friend and then we're going to Blue Water. So today's Saturday and it's presentation day. So for the girls football club, um, they get the whole club get involved and they all get given a little trophy and then also they have the awards for like players player managers player oppositions player and they all get awarded a trophy as well so as i'm one of the managers i need to go and help set up so the girls are coming with me and then craig will come along later uh, we've got to go and it's like a big fun day thing that they're doing so we've got to go and help set up the stalls um and every team is setting up a gazebo um and each gazebo is going to be decorated a different country for the world cup and we have been given mexico so we have some big flags i've got some bunting and then I got some blow up cactuses because when I googled Mexico stuff that's what came up so I thought why not I did get a piñata as well so I filled that with some sweets and some other little goodies for the girls to to play with as well um so yes yeah, so we've got to go and help set up setting up all the stalls ready for presentation day stay in line with where that came from. So I've got a nice healthy breakfast. We've got this deliciously Ella gluten and dairy free granola and it doesn't have any added sort of processed sugar. It's sweetened just with like maple syrup. And then I'm gonna have it with this dairy free yogurt that also is soya free as well. So I try not to eat too many soya products. And then I'm gonna add a few Blueberries to it. Yum, yum. So we've come to Emmett's garden, which is a National Trust property. And they're all laughing at me, taking the mickey oh, yeah. as usual. Um, so we've brought uh, a picnic with us. And I'll just show you what we've got. It's all all vegan, plant-based food. Most of it's healthy, not all healthy. So we got, I made some pasta. <laughs> so we've got pasta salad, which has also got some herbs in it, some cucumber, sweet corn, and some sunflower seeds. We've got some pepper, celery, carrot, broccoli, and some hummus. And then what else have we got? We have got some, these are Linda McCartney beef Wellington vegan sausage rolls. They are very nice. Also got some popcorn, some pistachio nuts, 
and we have got as well in here that they're keeping cool just some of these we've not had these ones before these ones you keep in the fridge we've had the ones that you put in the cupboard but these are like little yogurty things for later so that's our picnic Ooh. <laughs> lots of people and a nice view Daisies. Nice, aren't they, Lucy? Mm-hmm. When they come out like that. <laughs> you missed! <laughs> oh, Lucy, really? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Bounced over it. Oh, yes. <laughs> Lulu, what have you got? They're quite nice, aren't they? Are they? Do they taste different to the other ones? Do you think? You know the ones we had that were in yeah, the cupboard. Yeah, cold. Oh, cold. <laughs> do they any different? Do you think? I think they've got less sugar in them. This is soya. Yeah, but so is the other one. Oh. Yeah, so it's nice. Oh, yeah. I mean, Craig, football, playing football. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> trying to get through. People walk along here all the time, but I don't know. I'm never sure if it is a real footpath or if it's just that people use it. <laughs> but we're just walking up, up into the fields, to the gallops. Okay. So it's, it's nice walking in here. The only trouble is, is that people walk their dogs here. So anywhere where dogs walk, it's dog poo. And unfortunately, there's a lot of people that don't pick it up. So you have to watch where you're walking the whole time to make sure you don't tread in any. So we've been, had a lovely weekend. We had, um, their football presentations yesterday which was nice so I had to get up on stage and do a little speech which I was a bit nervous about but I think I think it went okay and the girls got their trophies and it was a lovely day it was there all day we helped set up Chloe and Lucy helped run a couple of the stalls oh okay just Chloe, not Lucy. And I helped run some stalls and then we helped pack away some of the stuff. Um, but the sun was out all day. Uh, and I think it was lovely. I think they raised quite a bit of money for the club, which is always good. And then today we went for a little picnic at somewhere called Emmett's Garden, uh, which is in Seven Oaks. It's a National Trust property. Um, and it's quite nice. We didn't really do much of the walking around there today, which we have done before. Um, we just literally went, set up a picnic blanket, ate our 
um, lunch as you have already seen and then they just played some football and then we came home well before we came home on the way home they, they we stopped off at um, their friends so they could play a little bit of football and then we came home so it's been a lovely day